Hello everyone, thank you for checking out today's video. My name is Michael and in this video I'm going to be covering how to create new users and how to edit existing users on ServiceNow. So while you have your instance open, you want to ensure that you have the appropriate roles. Uh, most likely you're going to be a system administrator or maybe the service desk if you're making these changes to user records. So if you head over to the All, the application, All Applications menu and you type in Users, if you come over to System Security, you'll see a Users option. And once you hop on here, it's going to see all the users that are in the user table on your instance. So from here, you can go ahead and find an existing user if you want to make a change there, or you can go ahead and create a new user. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a new user. And you want to create a user ID, first name, last name, you know, whatever's mandatory on your instance, it's going to vary. So for this one, we want to make sure that we have a unique user ID. So user test two, test test and we don't see the ast uh the red asterisk anywhere so it looks like none of these fields are even mandatory <clears throat> excuse me all right and then once we're done we have two options to save this record we can either right click anywhere on the header and hit save or we can just hit submit so let's go ahead and hit submit and we'll need to remember this user id because we're going to search for them in a second so this is user test two okay so submit all righty and let's come over to user id Oops, let's actually do it here. User test two, there we go. So we just found the user that we're looking for, user test two. So we can make changes either here on the list view by double clicking the cell, or we could actually head over to the record itself. Okay, once we're on the record itself, let's say we wanna add an email. So we'll do test at test.com for the email. And link, oop, just click clacking around and English for the language. And let's say that's all we want to edit for now. So once we're done, we could either hit update and that would take us back over to the list view or we, again, we could just hit save and that'll keep us on the same record. And that's it. It is that easy to create a new user and to edit an existing user on ServiceNow. If y'all enjoyed this video, please consider giving this video a like. Please also consider subscribing to the channel and I'll catch you all in the next video very soon.